I've been a nurse for 20 years and I'm damn good at it. I don't want to be a doctor. I like what I do. I like spending time with patients. I like being a patient advocate. If I hear one more nurse say, I'm the patient's advocate, what does that make me? The patient's enemy? Some nurses act like I'm an uncaring asshole who they need to protect their patients from. I'm a patient advocate. I'm compassionate. I'm a doctor. Now, I realize there are some difficult doctors who yell and scream and make life miserable, but they don't just attack nurses. They go after med students, residents, interns. Sometimes I think that's just how they learn to express authority, you know? See one, do one, teach one. What's the worst part of my job? Stress. stress. You want to know about stress? Don't get me started. Stress is my life. Try taking care of 10 patients at once. One needs blood sugar checked every two minutes. One has a temperature of 102. One's urine output is non-existent, and another has wet the bed. And one poor man has been begging for pain medication for two hours, but the intern won't return my page. You've needed to pee for three hours. You haven't eaten since yesterday. And the attending is freaking out because the x-rays she ordered 10 minutes ago aren't in her hands. And you're getting paged every, every five, five minutes. minutes. Yeah, I examined 20 patients, spent three hours filling out paperwork, met with the hospital attorney about some bogus lawsuit, and then I did more paperwork. My wife is having a meltdown, my kids don't know me, and sleep? I'm scheduled for surgery at 7 a.m. And at 2 a.m., a nurse calls me and wakes me up. And when I scrub in for surgery, I discover the chief OR nurse quit to become a drug rep. Is it any wonder I need Zantac, Xanax, Zoloft, chocolate. chocolate.